Dean Stacy has been blind for 17 years. Every day he takes insulin and up to 10 pills for diabetes and related conditions. And then on this one, I have a, a, a top on it so I can tell the difference. Taking the right meds is essential to his health. Getting them wrong, potentially dangerous. I can go into shock and, a, you know, diabetic shock or hypoglycemia. Not being able to manage his own prescriptions, a blow to his independence. It kind of takes away part of your dignity and it's a hit on your ego. For the past five years, Stacy has been lobbying his local drugstore, Rexall, to set him up with an easier system, talking prescriptions. Ready to scan. This sample product of Script Talk demonstrates the technology available in Canada since 2010. It uses a radio frequency chip on the bottom of the bottle. Instructions, take one capsule three times daily. Then it reads aloud the same information that's standard on all prescription labels. For years, Rexall told Stacy it was considering adopting the tech and in 2018 even promised him a solution. But last June, it changed course, informing Script Talk it wouldn't be purchasing the system after all. Advocates say anything less than full access to talking prescriptions is discriminatory. There is no reason why any drugstore, and especially a major established drugstore chain, isn't providing this on request, on site, without delay. Currently, there's a patchwork of drugstores offering Script Talk in Canada. Some chains, like Sobeys and Safeway, are offering same-day, on-demand talking prescriptions now. Shoppers Drug Mart offers the service, but it takes up to 48 hours to fill. Same with Walmart, and only in B.C. Loblaws doesn't offer it, but says planning is underway. After Go Public contacted Rexall, the drugstore apologized to Stacy, changed course again, and says it will offer talking prescriptions on a case by case basis. So Dean Stacy is anxiously waiting for that to include him. Carolyn Dunn, CBC News, Calgary.